All right, now sometimes we tend to clear off all the notifications from the notification panel without even looking at them thoroughly. And you may be wondering how can you again see the notifications which you have just dismissed from the notification panel. For this, we have got a very useful feature on OneUI 5.0 which we are going to take a look at in this video and I have also got a cool tip for you guys as far as the do not disturb mode is concerned. So keep watching the video and if you're new on the channel, be sure to subscribe and hit that like button if you find this video useful. Now the feature which we are going to take a look at is something known to most of you guys, but those of you who are new to Samsung, this is going to be really useful for you. And even those of you who have not explored this feature, it is going to be useful. So let's go ahead and tap on settings. I'll tap on notifications. Now here, we have got advanced settings option. I'll just tap on this. As you can see, we've got an option called notification history. Let's go ahead and tap on this. Here, just make sure you have turned on this toggle. By default, I think it should be on. If it is not on by default, go ahead and turn that on. You will be able to see all those recently dismissed notifications right here in this section. As you can see, it shows recently dismissed notifications. And if you keep scrolling down, as you can see, all the notifications are available pertaining to each application. You can just tap on this arrow to expand that and see the contents of those notifications. So it's a very handy feature we have got on One UI 5.0 and some of the previous iterations of One UI. I hope this would be useful for some of you guys. Now let's go back. Here we are on the main menu. Now here you can see we have got an option, do not disturb. I just tap on this. Now we all know what do not disturb does, right? So do not disturb mutes all calls, notifications and other alerts, except for those you choose to allow. Now here we have got some very useful options which you can enable if you are turning on the do not disturb mode automatically. This menu actually looks and works like routines. We've got a toggle to turn on do not disturb. We have this option for how long you want to turn on do not disturb. When you tap on this, you get to see options like until I turn it off for one hour, ask every time. And here on the right, we have got this plus and minus buttons. If you want to increase the number of hours or decrease the number of hours, you can just use these buttons to do that. Now here we also have an option schedule. Now under schedule we have got sleeping for which we have a toggle and below that we have got add schedule option as well. Here you can create a schedule name and you can set whichever day you want the do not disturb to be turned on and you can also set the time for that and then just tap on save. It turns on do not disturb feature as per the schedule that you have set. Right below this we have got this option allowed during do not disturb wherein we can set calls and messages from particular contacts, notifications from particular applications, or alarms and sounds, which will be allowed when the do not disturb mode is turned on. And right below this, we have got an option hide notifications, where you can enable these toggles to hide all the notifications or hide full screen notifications, or a few other options like hide app icon badges, hide from notification panel, don't show pop-up notifications toggle also we have, and then we have hide status bar icons. So all these can be customizable right here on this particular menu. So having so many options on this do not disturb feature on One UI 5.0, O is just amazing. It's a very thoughtfully executed feature on One UI. Let me know what do you think about these features. Drop a comment and I hope you have already subscribed to the channel. If you haven't done already, you should go ahead and subscribe to know your phone better and give this video a thumbs up if you find this useful. Thanks for watching. My name is Sally. I'm signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.